Hey guys, Fangius here, and my voice is really bad quality in uh, Camtasia, so bear with me guys, and uh, this is a tutorial on how to install Deadpool mod for GTA 4. It's really simple, and I uh, just felt like making a video because I'm bored, so uh, this the video is for Daniel on helping, because he really wants to know how to do it too, and there's no video only on how to install skins so I'm gonna make a video on how to install the Deadpool mod particularly so what this uh, mod is it makes so your skin is Deadpool blah 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 I use X-Men alt cause it looks pretty sick like but Daniel you're probably gonna use like regular classic or ultimate ultimate like black and gray with red eyes and stuff it's pretty sick and um, how you install them is uh, you open this folder, go to player bed, just put this to the side right here. Um, you want to open Spark IV. I have it um, over here. Sorry, let me get it out. Alright, and you want to open it. That was voice crack, I think. I have such a big cold, bear with me as well on that. So all I have to do is scroll scroll all the way down. There's models, CD images. Um, sorry for background noises. Player pad. You want open player pad. And you have this. You want to go to import. Go to desktop. Go to Deadpool pack. Go to the one you want. I want X-Men Alt. Go to player pad again. Hover over all of this. Hit open. And all you have to do is hit save, but I already installed it, and I think I'll screw it up. So I'm not going to do that. But yeah, that's how you install any skin practically. Like if I want to install a Minecraft skin or anything, all I have to do is drag it, uh, drag and drop into player pad. Everything works fine. The skins don't really do much to make it look cool. Um, yeah, but that's about it. Um, if you want more tutorials like this, hit that like button. If you want more videos, hit that subscribe button, and yeah, I'll see you next time. Boy, boy.